So I'm here in Word and I've got a few pages in here and you can see how many pages you've got by looking in the bottom left hand corner. It's actually telling me I've got page one of three here. So what I want to do is I want to actually put in the footer on this particular document telling me what page I'm on. So I'm going to include page numbers. So really easy to do. I can just go into insert on the tab at the top here and you'll see over here in this header and footer section it says page number. If I click on that you can see I can choose to put it at the top of the page that would be in the header and you can see there's various options plain number it's just got a one on the left hand side centered right and so on. You can see the styles that they've got here as well. So if you look through you'll see one that you might like. Same applies to the bottom of the page. If I want to put one in the bottom right hand side, I would just click on that. And I can now see in my footer and it has taken me into the footer section. So you can see when that happens on the ribbon at the top, you've now got a tab here for the design with header and footer tools. So you can see that there. So that has put it in for me. And if I was to go down to the next page, it says two, and three and so on. But what if I wanted to say actually page in front of it? Well I just type in page one and you'll see then it's done the same for all of these down here. I could go in and put in how many pages so it could say page one of three and I just have to simply type in page one of. What you do is if you're in the design bit here you can go into quick parts and choose field I'm not going to do that just yet because you can also do it by going into insert and you'll see here that there is also another bit which says quick parts. It's exactly the same. Just go into field and you can scroll down to one that says num pages, which is the number of pages and you choose the format that you want. I'm going to choose the format one, two, three. There isn't a numeric format for this such as having decimal places because you don't have decimal places as part of a page number. And I just click on OK and you can now see it says page one of three. Again if I scroll down you can see it says page two of three and so on. So by going back to the design here I can close the header and footer. You could put this in the header as well if you like and if I scroll down there you can actually see that they're in there. So the other way that you could do this is to go into insert and you could go into the header and you could actually go or footer and choose edit header. Once you start edi editing one of those just by scrolling down you can go down into this bit here. So if this wasn't here if I just delete that I can type in page without the caps lock switched on. I could now do this by going into my quick parts field and here I could choose by going down here the actual page that's telling me the page number. So if I click on that one and click on OK it's put that in and again if I want to do the page of with the page numbers once again I just go into that quick parts choose field and then I just choose num pages with that format there. So there you are. I can now close that header and footer and I've done it two different ways. One was by going into inserts and choosing the page number. The other one was by going into either the header and choosing the edit header or the footer and choosing edit footer and putting in the page numbers like that.